Yo, what's up everybody? Max Trax is back here live on Facebook for all you metalheads, my brothers and sisters of metal out there watching, people in bands, all fans, the whole tribe, fucking love all you guys, thank you for watching. Before we start, I have to give a shout out to Tony from ESP for giving me this beautiful, send me this beautiful black metal series, Flying V. I just got that a couple days ago. So thank you to Tony, Matt, and everybody at ESP. You guys rule. And this guitar, is, is, it's really killer. I love it. And uh, I was you know, thinking, I only did so far one Cavalera Conspiracy song. And we had a banger of an album a couple of years ago called Psychosis. So I decided to do a track out of Psychosis, the most kind of like crazy song on Psychosis is kind of like a, a throwback, black metal, morbid vision style kind of song, throwback called Judas Pariah. Yes. And the lyrics written about the first step of my journey and uh, some traitors in the way. But uh, really, really uh, awesome song, some sick riffs. A crazy awesome beat down in the end like a chugging beat down that you guys gonna love it so thank you for watching we're well, here we are max tracks Judas Pariah Covalera conspiracy <laughs> tune to C sharp I'm gonna come in with the drums. Was killer. I love the intensity, man. 
fucking killer killer. So let's start with the main riff. safe uh, I'm looking forward to some records coming out Carnation's got a record coming out in a couple of days um, you know like there's, a, there's been a lot of cool releases lately uh, Incantation I put the flag up there back there some real support to the underground but um, yeah so let's roll from the star again one more time and see Judas Pariah
bunch of noise. Judas, Berlin, Pariah, Scum. So there you have it, man. Judas Pariah, fucking banger all the way. I, there's no words to describe. I can't wait to play this shit live. Uh, we, we didn't have a chance to tour for Psychosis. Hopefully that comes next year. But uh, just killer fucking riffs all the way through. That fucking Andy. Chug that shit like it's the last thing you're doing on earth. <laughs> Heavy as fuck. I love it, man. And uh, I was trying to think of some uh, some Cavalera conspiracy stories. One of the coolest ones is a about it's a couple of years ago probably 2014 i was gonna say to, no no it was 2017 uh maybe 15 I, i'm i'm bad with dates man but was uh we got invited to play in dallas opening for the metallica show that they had there and it was a dime bag memorial um and I got to do um, a new level with King Diamond. It was fucking sick. It was awesome. It's on YouTube somewhere. And it was really killer meeting the king, you know. It was hanging out, take a picture with him. It was awesome, man. And we also got to jam in Metallica's jam room, which that was really sick, too. And uh, it was really cool. Um, and, uh, <laughs> yeah. And there's a little funny story that I'm going to say anyway, because it's punk rock, man. <laughs> That's how our family grows. I mean, um, we're hanging out backstage and stuff, and Lars was there, you know, hanging out. And uh, fucking my wife asked, uh, my wife asked Igor for once to take a, and, uh, take a picture with Lars. And uh, he's like, no, I'm good. <laughs> it was like, okay, man, fucking... All right, you're pretty punk rock, you know. He already told the he, he flip off the corn guys in Australia anyway a couple of years before that. So you got to keep the punk spirit underground alive in the Cavalera family compound. But uh, that was fucking sick, man. You know, record, you know, playing live in the big show and jamming in the room, jamming in the room, and then we do the King Di song with King Diamond, and then we had the Cavalera show. Um, and then from, uh, just from our, our childhood memories, there was one time that we went, we went out, uh, to a cemetery one day in the middle of the afternoon. We skipped school and went to a cemetery and we saw this grave. There was an open grave full of skulls and we robbed a skull from the grave. And I was like, I don't take this shit home. You know, my mom will kill me, you know? And then... We had another friend of, of, with us, and uh, we didn't know what to do with the motherfucking skull. Some bad karma from that shit, still paying for it today. Anyway, we end up just going into a big uh, bridge on, on top of a highway, and we threw the skull from the, from the bridge, and it just splattered down the highway. And it's just memories of, you know, brain-dead teenagers doing stupid shit in Brazil. Listen to Venom and Hellhammer going out robbing skulls. Fucking just crazy Brazilian teenagers. But it was cool, man. Me and my brother did a lot of crazy shit like that. And uh, it's cool that we, we still jam together. We still do Cavalera together. Um, so, yeah, that was, that was fun. That was a, that was a great uh, fucking song. Um, I'm going to do the... Um, I'm gonna do the riffs for you guys. 
I'm also going to, um, let me just look here real quick. Um, yeah, the lyrics are really cool. I'll work with them with Arthur. You live because I gave you life. When I fed you your drink, you spare me with your knife and drain the well eternal, unworthy parasite. Life is rolled this way, but hell on earth is real. You drown in your own shit. Dear them, shining with your teeth, vivid on my throne, I drink from your bones. You choke the ashes of your life, asphyxiated Judas, fucking worthless vermin, traitor crucifixion. That's some fucking hard fucking lyrics, man. That shit is hard. One of the hardest lyrics I ever written. Really pissed off. Really fucking pissed off Max at that. Writing some Judas Pariah for my uh, for the early stages of back in the day life, you know. And uh, so, yeah. Uh, message from the Brazilian fans as always. We give aí galera do Brasil. Essa de hoje foi Judas Pariah. É que é do Cavalera Conspiracy, música bem ferrada mesmo, e falando da, da, das traições que rolaram na, na época que a gente morava do Brasil, e vocês sabem quem, de quem que eu tô falando, né? São dos impostores que estão lá até hoje, estão lá e continuam usando as nossas músicas e usando tudo que a gente fez, e nunca, nunca deram nenhum obrigado, bando de filha da puta. Mas, meu, é, isso é a vida. Então, continuem escutando, continuem ouvindo o Max Tracks, eu curto pra caralho a força de vocês, escutem Psicoses no volume máximo que puder, é um disco muito foda, espero que tenha turnê o ano que vem aí no Brasil pra gente fuder tudo. Fiquem com saúde, Max Cavalera sempre tá com vocês, tá? Então, so thank you so right now for um, Max Picks before I play the whole song one more time for you guys. Uh, this album was produced by Arthur Risk. He's a good friend of ours. And he's a great producer, man. He did the Power Trip Records, you know, the big one. Um, and I Manifest Decimation. He also did Nightmare Logic. Um, he does... Outer Heaven, Cold Orange, he does a lot of cool shit. Arthur is an awesome guy, and I love his uh, power metal, heavy metal stuff, Summerlands, and Eternal Champion. We always talk about old school metal, you know, listen to Angel Witch and, um, you know, Witchfinder General and all the cool shit. Anyway, the pick I have is Peace Grave from Philadelphia. I don't know what's going on. Literally, I'm losing the CD covers of this the, of my collection. But I got the CDs so I can play everywhere I go. I'm still old school. I still believe in the power of CDs. Although I prefer vinyl. I'm trying to get some vinyl now. Um, this is a sick fucking record, man. Really crazy recorded. I love the production. It's kind of like the uh, the Arthur crazy death metal productions that he does, you know, similar to the Black Curse record that, I, that he did that I fucking love that record, it's such a good record. Um, this one is crazy, awesome, awesome songs, if you guys don't have it, check it out, they're from Philadelphia, um, Profound Lore Records, Peace Grave, crazy, great name too, Peace Grave, killer name for a band. Alright, so let's do a playthrough. Do a playthrough of Judas Pariah and uh, we'll wrap it up. It was killer. <laughs>
Christian destroyer. on this part is the lyrics actually that ends so it goes integrity is not for play you think this is the game just do what I create so it's that integrity is not for play you think this is the is this is a game just do what I create fuck yeah Judas Pariah Let's do the ending one more time with the band. It'll be sweet. Go! Conspiracy, Judas Pariah. Thank you so much for watching Max Trax. Thanks all you guys. Truffle sleeping today. He's passing out. Not even the metal can wake him up. There you go, Max Trax. We'll see you guys Saturday with another banger. everybody keep the metal stay safe stay metal i love you all max fucking trash